Good morning, everybody. It's that time again. Time to get ready for work. Let's go. This is my shirt of choice today. Go download the Duncan Rewards app. I'm wearing different jeans today. Give me one second to take care of my mustache. I have a mustache story time. I seem to have a scratch on my face. That was not there when I went to bed. I started growing in a mustache when I was like literally 11. And for a long time, like a year, we were just bleaching it. But I had just like so many hairs, it was just really visible. So we started waxing my mustache off and that was fine for a while until when I was like 13, I started going to the dermatologist for my skin. And when I started waxing after being on these medicines for my skin, the wax would literally rip my skin off. Like the entire area that had wax on it, no skin. And I would just like go to school like that with like, Two no skin strips. Anyways. Hi. If you've never seen me before, I work at Duncan. Oh, it's such a fun time. No, I actually really enjoy it. I would enjoy it so much more if like the customers were decent human beings. No offense. If you're offended by that, then you're probably not the problem. I'm also an opener at Duncan, so I have to start work at 4.30 in the morning. It's not nearly as terrible as you might expect it to be. Your body starts to get used to it, I promise. Some sex. I've been having fun at work the past couple weeks. It is humorous that I said that, considering the fact that the day I recorded this, I had such a terrible day at work. Oh, and this is Charlie. Hi, Charlie. I've done another video like this before. And it was really fun, but today I want to talk about some story times. Because as I'm sure you can probably imagine, I've got some stories. Alright, so we're going to start specifically at last week. I am pretty much always on front counter, but last Saturday they decided to put me on drive through This lady came through the drive through and... She gets to the window. I hand her all of her drinks and everything. And I start taking like the next order on my headset. Keep in mind, I'm taking orders, making drinks, and cashing people out the window. Like I'm a little bit overwhelmed. This woman like knocks on the drive through window and I was like, that's new. I open the window and she's like, is this decaf? And I was like, no. Well, I can't drink it. I can only drink decaf. Oh. Well, you ordered regular. And she was like, no, I didn't. Hey guys, I'm just saying, if you said decaf, I would have given you a decaf. Like, I remade it and everything, but it's just like, pay attention when you're ordering, please, because it takes ev everybody's time. And she was quite sassy as well. I was like, girl, I'm gonna give you your decaf. I'm just letting you know. Like, literally not even five minutes later, somebody else pulls into the drive-thru. She asks for a small hot coffee with one cream and seven sugars. She then pulls around. I hand her her small hot coffee, one cream, seven sugars. And she's just sort of looking at me. Is there something wrong? She's like, one cream, seven sugars? I was like, I was like, I can't read your mind. <laughs> like, I don't know what's wrong here. She was like, Oh, no, I wanted a small hot black coffee with one cream and seven sugars on the side. And I was just supposed to know that? I don't want to get out of my seat right now. I took a statistics test yesterday and I got a 98%. I said this in my last video, but there's literally nothing that I hate more than starting my car when it is pitch black outside, so. We've been training like a lot of new people lately, so honestly, like that's been a lot of like the work drama is just like these new people. Like literally nothing wrong with them. Well, 
guess I'm not really allowed to get into that specifically. Some people just don't pull their weight, you know? I worked drive through on Super Bowl Sunday and it was crazy. Oh my god, we like ran out of donuts. Like literally no donuts. I think we sold like 10 dozen by 6 a.m. On Saturdays, I open with the store manager, which sounds like really, I don't know, like scary or something, I don't know. But she actually started working there, like, pretty similar to when I started working there, so I've known her, like, the longest out of everybody, and we actually, we get along really well and stuff. Don't forget your deodorant. Hey. Now that it look hideous. Yay! I made it! <laughs> ah. Here I am. Favorite place to be. I grabbed a bubbly as well. Okay, I guess I'm gonna go in now. I just got out of work. I'm not feeling too well, to be honest. Ow. Ow. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you like and subscribe for more. If you really like me, then you should check me out on all of my other social medias at Cassidy Lee Quinn on TikTok, at Cassidy Lee Quinn on Instagram, and at Cassidy Lee on Depop. Hey, I'm just popping in to quickly say that I'm going to be on spring break next week, so I will be posting a bunch of stuff on Depop, so definitely go follow me to see all of that. That's all. Speaking of Depop, I have to go to the post office to drop off a package. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you around. Bye!